All right. So I do have two people here. Oh, now it says I've got one viewer. I bet it's going to take a second here. So... I'm going to go ahead... Um, oh, five viewers. There we go. Can you hear me? That's the big question. Can you see me? I can see me on my... I have my desktop computer watching the break, and I have my tablet recording the break. So I just need somebody to tell me for sure that you can hear me. All right. I'm just going to type that into chat. Can you hear me now? Sorry, we're getting a little bit of a late start here, guys. All right, you can hear me. Perfect. I'm going to go ahead and start this break then. Again, sorry for the wait a little bit. Got this in a little bit earlier this morning. So this is a fresh case. I'm just going to do the once around, but I haven't opened it yet. Good. I'm glad it's working. I might have to do this tablet thing more, now, oh, especially now that my video camera just decided to go out on me. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to open this up. Oh, it's a case inside a case. All right. All right. I wasn't sure. I figure it's better safe than sorry. Looked a little big. All right. I gotta. I gotta go pour the, out these. And then I'll show you the brand new case again. All right. That's better. So this is a brand new case. Let's try that again. That looks more like a case from Tops. Just looks like it's a late case from Tops. Alright, the way I'm going to do it is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you the boxes here and take them all out. Uh, apparently they don't do the two, they're not doing the two six box cases. So um, that's going to kind of be easier in a way because I don't have to open up two inner cases. I know there's more of you in there. Stand up to do this. Uh, so I'm going to open all of these first so that I... all the packs and then just we'll break them all at the same time or open all the boxes and then we'll open all the packs at the same time Packs are really thin. Let's get a really thick one. Only good things come in really thick packages. It's the first time I've actually ever opened Tier 1. It's never been one that I've opened for myself. Um, I've opened some of the other, you know, premium products or whatever Tops calls them, um, like Tribute. And triple threads. But 
but never tier one. And I've heard some really mixed reviews about tier one this year. Some people saying it's a lot better than last year. Some people saying that it's uh, terrible. So hopefully get we get one of the really good ones. I know the checklist is pretty strong, but um, I know there are redemptions. I've heard a lot of people saying that there are redemptions, quite a bit, quite a few redemptions, which might explain why they're not as thick, or we may just be getting the base, or you know, the basic. Let's see, that's that's how thick they are so far. Not very. But, you know, there's always some good autos. And if you're into relics, there's some decent relics, too. couple more here. My fingers are much faster at opening packs than opening these individual boxes. But you know you can't you can't search the boxes for the bat knobs. You have to actually open them. All right. So we have got here 12 packs. 12 boxes of tier 1. So Without further ado, we are going to start breaking. All right, Drew Smiley on the Rise autograph of 399 and a redemption card. So it's a Jersey relic of CC Sabathia, and the redemption is. Dual Auto Tier 1 Relic of Ken Griffey Jr. and Jay Bruce. Boy, is that not a good way to start this break. Come on, focus here. Come on, focus. That is a Dual Auto Tier 1 Relic of Ken Griffey Jr. and Jay Bruce Redemption. Wow, it's going to be hard to beat that one. <laughs> Are you guys, did you guys see that? You guys aren't saying anything in the chat. That's quite a, quite a card there. Uh, we got Scott Diamond to three ninety nine. A crowd pleaser autograph of. Where's the name on there? That's Sean Markham. A jersey relic of Jose Bautista to three ninety nine, and a dual relic. Of Steven Strasburg, number to fifty. And we have an autograph of Chris Archer, number to 399. We have another crowd pleaser autograph, number to 299, of Jim Rice. Yeah, that was Jay Bruce and Ken Griffey Jr. dual autograph redemption. So yeah, Jay Bruce. <laughs> and then Mark Trumbo, Jersey Relic, number to 399. Both Reds outfielders at one point. Yeah, that's probably why. Um, and who are they going to put with Ken Griffey Jr. In the, from the Mariners? Got another four-card pack here. Wow, that's a good one, too. It's not bad. It's not bad. This is an on-the-rise autograph of Avisail Garcia, number 10 of 10. So that is number 10 of 10, Avisail Garcia on-the-rise autograph. Got another crowd pleaser to 299. This is John J. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, Jason Kipnis, number to 399, Jersey Relic. And David Fries, number to 399, Jersey Relic. Got another redemption back here. There's a Casey Kelly uh, on the rise autograph to 399. This is Johnny Peralta, crowd pleaser autograph, number 299. And the redemption is a tier one relic of R.A. Dickey. Tier one relic of R.A. Dickey. Now that really makes me wonder why are the relics. Um, why are the relics redemptions? I don't have to wait for anybody to sign that. Um, interesting. But either way, R.A. Dickey, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, someone in chat saying that we still have a Tier 1 auto and a patch auto to get. So, not bad at all so far. All right. Oh, that's got a little ding on the corner, but it's an on the rise autograph to 399 of Brock Holt. The Boston Red Sox, you can't really tell because. I'm not focused very well, but uh, there's a little ding on the corner. This is an Adam Jones crowd pleaser autograph, numbered to 99. And I saw the back of this one. This one's pretty cool. This is Jersey Relic. It's numbered to 399, but that is Craig Biggio. Right there. Garcia's the case hit. Not 10 of 10. Nice. Can't, uh, can't argue with that. All right. Oh, that's not a bad one either. On the rise autograph. It's a little streaky. Number to 399, John Segura. What in the world? You can hardly tell. But this is a crowd pleaser autograph numbered to 25 of Don Sutton and the video is not really doing justice here there you go you can kinda of see it it's a black autograph on a black card of Don Sutton number 25 interesting and then we have a dual jersey relic of Nelson Cruz number 50 whoever gets that one if you're a Texas Rangers fan, I hear that uh, if Texas makes the postseason, they're going to welcome Cruz back from his 50-game suspension. So he might be playing in the playoffs this year if Texas makes it, which looks like they're going to. Oh, boy. That card on the back, I'll show you here in a second. It's Felix Dubrant on the rise autograph, number to 399. Here's the Tier 1 autograph. It's numbered to 69. This is Bob Gibson. Yeah, it's an Invisa Auto. Nice. One of one, right? <laughs> On that Don Sutton. But this is Bob Gibson, number to 69. That's a, that's a great looking card. And that's the Tier 1 autograph that we're supposed to get. So we should have one more. We should have a patch autograph coming up in these next couple of packs. And then if he wasn't having elbow issue or arm issues, that is a Matt Harvey Relic, number to 399. Not bad. Nice blue going on. All right, Anthony Ghost on the rise autograph, 399. It's another Boston Red Sox. It says uh, Fred Lynn, numbered to 180 in the crowd pleaser autograph. And number to 399, Jersey Relic of John Lester. We got another redemption in here. Willie Peralta, number 299. Uh, and we have a fielder, number 399, Jersey Relic. And congratulations, you're due to receive a clear reprint rookie autograph of Sandy Koufax from 2013 Tier 1 Baseball. Uh... Wow, Sandy Koufax. That is a nice autograph. I don't even know what that's numbered to, but it doesn't really matter because it's Sandy Koufax. <laughs> that is very nice.
very nice. Wow, we got some great hits in here. Um, and, you know, even the, even the basic stuff isn't too bad. And we got another redemption in here. So here's Adam Eaton on the Rise Autograph, number to 399. And a Jason Hayward jersey relic, number to 399. And congratulations, you are due to receive a crowd pleaser auto base of Tom Glavin. Yet another not bad autograph at all. Wow. Uh, not sure what that would be numbered to. The crowd pleasers um, have been interesting. They have been different so far. It might be three ninety nine. But here we go, the last pack. This should be our Jersey Relic. Um, yeah, everybody in chat's just saying, wow, this is a great break, guys. <laughs> this is a great break. On the Rise Autograph, Tyler Skaggs, number to three ninety nine. Brandon Phillips, crowd pleaser, number 299. A dual bat relic of Johnny Bench, numbered to 50. This case is crazy. And we have Tony Gwynn, bat relic, numbered to 399. So we did not get a patch autograph in here, but um, I am not complaining in the least about the that at all. I'm going to go ahead and just do a quick recap here and then I'll make the separate videos and we'll uh, and then I'll get a list up tonight for everybody. So, here's the recap. Um, why don't I I'm going to put these in order first. Just make it easy. Um, but yeah, that's that's the case, guys. Um, I'm I'm speechless. This is actually a really good case. <laughs> it's a really good case. Um, I'm surprised, honestly. And that's our tier one autograph. That's so strange. The invisible autograph on there for that Don Sutton. The Koufax is numbered out of 25. You have got to be kidding me. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I'm kind of, kind of sad I didn't buy myself a case and open this one for me, but I'm actually really glad that we, we got this for a break because really I don't think anybody is going to complain. And even... Even, you know, down into the 20s is not going to be a bad pull at this point. It was a great case. All right. Um, let's do a quick recap here. So, here we go. A quick recap of one case of Tier 1. Wow. Good case here. CC Sabathia, Jersey Relic, 399. Steven Strasburg, dual Jersey Relic of 50. Jose Bautista. Mark Trumbo. Jason Kipnis, if I'm not saying what it's of, it's of $3.99. David Fries, Craig Biggio, Nelson Cruz, dual jersey out of 50. Matt Harvey, John Lester, Prince Fielder, Jason Hayward, Tony Gwynn, and Johnny Bench, number to 50. Dual. Uh, we're going to look at our on the rise autographs here. Um, Number to 399, unless I say differently. Casey Kelly, Brock Holt, John Segura, Felix Dubron, Anthony Ghost, Willie Peralta, Adam Eaton, Tyler Skaggs, Drew Smiley, Scott Diamond, Chris Archer, and number 10 of 10, Avasail Garcia. And our crowd pleaser autographs, numbered to 299, unless I say differently. Uh, Sean Markham, Jim Rice, John Jay, Will, Johnny Peralta, uh, Adam Jones, numbered to 99. Don Sutton, numbered to 25. There is an autograph on there. It's just really hard to see. Oh, look at that. If I shine the light right on it, you can see it. In person, you really can hardly see that. Uh, Fred Lynn, numbered to 180, and Brandon Phillips, numbered to 299. Then we have our case 
tier one autograph. This is numbered to 69, and it's Bob Gibson. And our redemptions, and I was corrected, um, we are going to, um, we did get our dual, um, our autograph patch. Uh, it's in here, but um, so here are the redemptions. A tier one relic of R.A. Dickey. Crowd Pleaser Base Auto, which is probably numbered to 299 of Tom Glavin. A dual autograph tier one relic of Ken Griffey Jr. and Jay Bruce. Not sure what that's numbered to. Um, and then what I think is probably the best one in the case, um, unless somebody wants to correct me on that. This is a clear reprint rookie autograph of Sandy Koufax, and I'm told that this is numbered out of 25. So there you go, folks. That's our case of Tier 1, and I will get these videos uploaded as soon as I can, and I will get a list, and we can start drafting. Thanks a lot.